we've made it to Houston. We're here in the heart of Radio Row. Both teams now in town as well. The Atlanta Falcons got here yesterday afternoon, so they've settled in to their team hotel. It's about 15 miles from the heart of downtown. They'll hold all their team-related activities, including practice at nearby Rice University. And two of the biggest questions facing this team, their lack of Super Bowl experience overall on the roster, and also whether or not their young defense that starts four rookies can hold up against Tom Brady and the Patriots. What they do have, though, is a head coach in Dan Quinn who has experience on both fronts. Quinn was a defensive coordinator with the Seattle Seahawks for their last two Super Bowl trips. And in Super Bowl 49, one of those games, they went up against Tom Brady. Now, while they lost, they were able to frustrate Brady, intercepting him twice. Now, this Atlanta defense, not necessarily those Seattle units, but it's a group that's improved, especially over the playoffs and facing quarterbacks like Russell Wilson and Aaron Rodgers. Now, on the health front, two injuries that we'll monitor all week, the health of Julio Jones' sprained toe. He suffered the injury in week 13. He'll be limited, but he will obviously play in this game. Alex Mack, the center, he suffered a fibula injury in the NFC title game. He didn't practice all last week, but again, expected to play. And there are two guys that Matt Ryan will count on in a big way in this game. And Matt Ryan's just the latest in a long list of quarterbacks from the state of Pennsylvania to play in the Super Bowl. Joining our guy, Rich Gannon.